Hello everybody, I'm Yvette of Uniquely Yvette. Welcome to my channel, or welcome back. I'm going to do one more Christmas in July project this week. This isn't really Christmas, it's more like, you know, winter in July, but hey, it's so hot, sometimes you need that little cool breeze coming through. And we can pretend that there's a cool breeze coming through with this project, okay? So, I've got a lot going on on this and i hope it all comes together i have no idea of color paint and all of that i'm concentrating on putting the elements together first so this is a scroll saw layering project i'm going to trace everything on this quarter inch plywood using my carbon paper here this is a little sled if you can tell with some mittens on it some words on it blah 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 we've got some snowflakes couple different sizes. I'm going to duplicate this one and put it over here. And then we have a snowflake at the top. So as I said, I've traced everything on here. I've got it all traced out right here. I'm going to cut up the different pieces as far as the sled itself. This is going to be in five different slices. And then I'm going to figure out these long bars that are going to be behind it to connect all of these together along with these top two pieces so it's about 20 inches long it's going to be about um seven inches wide it's like a door hanger or you could just hang it on the wall now that i've traced out all the design on here let's move to the scroll saw and cut these pieces out freezing cut out and I'm considering putting like a, a backer behind it and what I'm using to do that is I'm using this little washer and I'm going to put my pencil in it and hope it works the edge of it butts up against the edge of the word I'm putting my pencil in and then go like this it'll make the distance around the word equidistance all the way around I hope so like that now let's see can you see this so then I cut out this piece, so I cut out all around this line, and then fit this, glue this over it, and then that solid whole piece will be on our design. But I don't know if it's going to come up too high, but I'm just going to go ahead and cut it out and see how it works out. Alright y'all, here is everything cut out, sanded, as well as I'm going to sand, and ready to put together. Now, I've made these lengths of um, stick here 
um, here's three of them here, three of them here. I think they are about a half inch in width. And the length of the longest ones is 17 inches or so. I think one of these, this middle one, might be a little shorter than the other two. Just a little. And the length of the shorter ones is six and a half inches. I'm going to put holes here on the sides of this. And then I'm going to put in some rope so that this could be hung on a door. Okay, it's time to start painting the pieces. Wish me luck that I make good choices. <laughs> assembly so I'm going to turn these over on the wrong side and I'm going to move them in just the tiniest bit of a gap and I'm going to be using hot glue but if you did this I would use something stronger or more longer lasting than hot glue so if this if you hung this on your door on the outside the cold Temperatures in the winter time might make the hot glue fail. So you definitely want to use something that'll hold it long term or at least through the season. Okay, now we're ready to put on the long sticks. Make sure that the painted side turns this way. And this will be the top of the project. You want to make this part down just a tiny bit past the end of here because you want to leave plenty up here for these top pieces to go on. So I'm going to put them, I'm going to put these long pieces on the very edge of these little sticks here. And now the middle piece will be just above here. Okay, now we can turn it over and start decorating the front. Now we're ready to put these top pieces on. I'm going to give a little bit of space. All right, I found this false snow in my stash somewhere. I think I probably bought it from the Dollar Tree a long time ago. And I thought I'd decorate the top of this word, you know, as if snow is on it. So I'm just going to put some clear glue at the top. And I'm just going to pour it on there. I think I'm going to let that dry a little and then put some more on there because I really want it to be on there pretty heavily. Okay, now that we got all the snow at the top dry, we're going to glue it to its backer. I hope I get it lined up correctly. All right, fingers crossed that we get this right. <laughs> that was easier than I thought. There we go. I decided to make some cuffs for the mittens. Now we'll attach the snowflakes. I think I'm going to put the rope in the top in these holes before before I put the whole thing together. I like that. And get some more here. You don't need a whole lot. I mean, it's just, just a door hanger and you'll have a hook. Looks good. And now we can start assembly.
There we go. It's done. And that's our project. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel. Give me a comment below and let me know what you think. And thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.